I took geometry class in high school, I often needed to draw a quick circle for a math problem. However, no matter how hard I tried, I couldn't seem to draw a decent circle. Compasses aren't very convenient to carry around. They can be expensive and hard to buy. They're also hard to use and they leave a hole in the paper. I've tried using coffee lids, bottle caps, and other circular objects, but they never seem to be the right size, and they don't work too well either. Today, I will teach you how to draw a perfect freehand circle. You won't need any fancy tools or equipment, only pen, paper, and your hands. This is a quick and simple technique I've been using for many years. First, we need a clean surface to work on. A hard, smooth surface like a desk works best. Before we start, I will give you a quick rundown on how a simple compass works. There's an anchor leg and a pivot leg. The anchor leg is a needle point that sticks to the paper. The pivot leg is adjustable for the size of the circle. Then the paper is rotated 360 degrees to create a perfect circle. In the freehand technique, our hand will become the compass. Locate the fifth knuckle of your dominant hand and place it firmly on a sheet of paper. This will act as the anchor point in our compass. Notice that the paper can rotate freely about this point. Then, hold your pen in your dominant hand and slowly lower it to touch the paper. Make sure to keep your hand perfectly still. With your other hand, Begin rotating the paper around the anchor point of your knuckle. Remember to keep your pen at a constant distance from the center of the circle. This will result in a perfect circle. We can also use other anchor points to pivot around. Locate the tip of your thumb and place it firmly on the piece of paper. We are able to draw a smaller circle with this technique. We can also use the tip of our index finger. This will make an even smaller circle. If we use the end of our palm as the anchor point, we can draw a very large circle. This one even came off the paper. We aren't just limited to these four sizes of circles. Within each pivot point, we can adjust our pen grip to make micro adjustments in the size of the circle. There is basically an infinite amount of sizes we can make with this freehand technique. A further benefit of this technique is that we can use any type of pen, marker, pencil, or writing utensil we want. We can use different colors, different styles, and different materials. When using the compass, we can only use this provided pencil. Ultimately, this freehand circle technique is a convenient, simple, and easy way to draw any size circle with any writing instrument. Now get out there and draw some circles. <laughs>